First, we have Sonia Chachki. Hi, guys. I'm Sonia. I'm actually currently a student at Tufts University um, in Boston, but I'm coming to visit my wonderful friends here. Um, and so, when I was a freshman in college, um, I was really, really interested in marketing. And I thought marketing was like magic. It, it was beautiful words and texts and pictures that compelled people to take action. And that was really powerful for me. So after my, my freshman year, I did a small marketing internship in, in my hometown of Tampa, Florida. And um, I worked on a social media for one of our clients. And I saw that social media could really create a community in a way that was not possible um, offline. Um, so we had, the, the client was an RV dealer, and so we had RVers from across the country sharing their experiences and their stories and their pictures and their tips and tricks, and I thought this was so cool. Um, and one thing about advertising and marketing that was kind of digging at me and kind of the hole that Kevin was talking about earlier, there's a, a hole there because advertising and marketing can be used very manipulatively can be very manipulative um, and, and try to get people to do things that they probably shouldn't do um, or shouldn't buy. Um, so I thought, what if this same sort of community could be created around social causes? How powerful would it be if you could compel somebody to take action to change the world? So um, in my sophomore year, I uh, was introduced to a, f a friend of my brother's who was starting a company that was actually perfectly in line with what I wanted to do, which was social media consulting for nonprofits and social enterprises. And um, it's called KIPP Solutions. And basically, we have worked with clients um, from around the world that are doing incredible things. One of them was actually an unreasonable fellow, and we got to go see him pitch at the climax. Um, but what was really the turning point in my life was when I joined KIPP, and I am a completely different person now than I was then. And I don't think that a year ago, if you'd have told me that I was who I am now, um, I, would laugh in, I would have laughed in your face because I have never imagined something like this would happen and, and would take place. So it's not crazy and, and a big thing that's unreachable. Um, and the, it seems when you watch these people and see the things that they're doing, it seems like, oh my gosh, how could I ever do something like that? That seems so incredible and so amazing. But I think the, it, the first step is just seeing what, what is there and, and that those things are <coughs> able to be tackled and able to be um, really, you can get involved in those things. And I think that KIPP may not be what I'm doing for the rest of my life, but I think that it's opened a door of not only opportunity, but per personal discovery of now I know what I'm most passionate about and where I'm going to go from here. So, um, that's my story. Uh, how many like, newspapers is Kip in? Um, so we are... <laughs> so we I, are think, I think you guys need to get a, like, get a taste for what Kip is. Um, and then you do a good job of introducing Sonia. Okay. Um, so, so Sonia's the COO. She's second in command at Kip. And okay. y'all were ranks Inc's like, top 30. Yeah, so we were really lucky to be named um, one of Inc. Magazine's coolest college startups for this year, and um, we were featured in um, the Boston Globe, which is really exciting, and on NBC and a couple other media outlets. So it was really fun. <laughs> 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 but yeah. Mexico because of this. Yeah. <laughs> well, but the the point is, it's the. Ne never would have seen it coming. Like, never would have thought that this was possible. So, like, it seems it seems really impossible, but you don't even expect that it will be there. I'm sure if you had asked these entrepreneurs a couple years ago if they would be on that stage pitching in front of 800 people, they would have laughed in your face too. Um, but there are definitely concrete ways of getting there, and we are going to talk about that later. But that is me. So, thank you. Thank you.